If you're looking to build your own website for your small business and you have essentially zero experience, well fortunately for you there are two easy to use website builders called Squarespace and Wix, which are currently the most popular website builders on the market today. Hey guys, if you're new to this channel, my name's Stuart, thanks for joining me. Today we decided to create a comparison video between the two most powerful website builders on the internet, Squarespace and Wix. Today I'm going to cover the pros and cons of each of these website builders and break down the important features you need to consider before you get started. And I'll also share with you the types of websites and businesses that best work with each of these website builders. Now just quickly, if you're new to this channel, consider subscribing to stay updated with new and actionable videos and tutorials designed to help your small business thrive online. And with that said, let's find out what website builder, Squarespace or Wix, is best for your small business and your requirements. Okay, so first of all, I'm just going to cover the advantages and disadvantages of Wix, then jump onto Squarespace, and at the end, I'll give you a full comparison between the two and recommendations to get you started based on what website builder is going to be the best fit for your business. Okay, so let's jump into Wix. The first advantage of using Wix is the ADI feature, the Artificial Design Intelligence. Basically, this allows you to answer a few questions about your business needs and website requirements. Then what Wix will do is provide a customized website based on the questions you have answered. This is great for those with zero website experience and want to quickly get their website up online. The other great thing about Wix is they have a free plan to get you started and the option to upgrade at any time with a comprehensive plan starting at $12.50 per month. Now you also have the option to choose from the 500 plus pre-made professional website templates to build off rather than just starting from scratch. Now when it comes to actually building your website, Wix provides an extremely user-friendly drag and drop visual builder. This makes it super easy for anyone to quickly make changes, add elements and content to the website. You can just click on each section to start editing or navigate over to the left to simply add additional pages, backgrounds to the pages or sections in the form of video or images and you can also simply add other features like buttons, images, gallery and more. Wix makes it super easy for you to navigate and find what you are looking for with the visually pleasing interface. Now another great feature of Wix is the all-in-one app integrations that you can simply add to your website without any coding. Just find the app that you need and click and add that to your website and then just complete the guided setup. Now, just quickly, before we compare Wix with Squarespace, let's look at some of the disadvantages of using Wix. Firstly, the free subscription has a paid advertising uh, kind of banner on your website, making it look very unprofessional. Also, there is basically no structure if you're designing from scratch, and you can easily accidentally make your website look strange and ugly. I also find that changes on the desktop version sometimes looks quite different and deformed in the mobile view and it can take some time to make changes and kind of fix it to the way that you like and make all the elements responsive on both desktop and mobile. Now what I'll do is I'll put a Wix tutorial up above so you can get started and build your Wix website right away. Now if we head over to Squarespace, I identify Squarespace as a more upmarket website builder with more elegance and professionalism compared to Wix. Squarespace, like Wix, has many website templates to choose from and customize. However, I find Squarespace as more of a structured website builder. 
Basically, no matter how hard you try, your website will always look stunning and sharp. The Visual Website Builder is similar to Wix in that you just need to click and start editing. Although the Wix Website Builder is easy to use for beginners. However, once you get your head around Squarespace and, and how to actually build the website with Squarespace, the building experience then makes more sense. For example, if you want to add a new section, just come down and click the plus button and this will provide an abundance of sections for you to add and you can visually see how they will look before you add them to your website. Now Squarespace is also a great option for e-commerce websites. If you sell products online, Squarespace is a powerful option and allows for easy customizations to emails and invoices. Plus, the product pages are simple and easy to navigate for customers. Also, because of the elegance of Squarespace, I would recommend building blogs with this website builder as Squarespace offers easy to use scheduling, post building features and a beautiful blog experience for both readers and writers. Now, the disadvantages of using Squarespace. Well, firstly, unfortunately, the Squarespace application, the website builder, does not have a free subscription like Wix does. However, they do offer a 14-day free trial to encourage you to get started. Prices start from around $18 per month for a comprehensive plan compared to Wix that is currently at $12.50 per month. The Squarespace website builder is not as user friendly as Wix and takes a bit more time to get used to. Also, Squarespace has fewer app integrations and functionality. And lastly, if you require specific changes to sections or layouts on your Squarespace website, this will require code and help from a experienced web developer. So now that we've discussed the two website builders, which one is better for your requirements and your small business? Well, we have Wix on one side which has more templates, app integrations, an ADI builder and a free subscription plan, as well as a powerful visual drag and drop builder. Prices start from $12.50 per month. Now Wix is ideal for service based businesses, small local businesses like cafes, builders and restaurants. Now Squarespace has elegant templates, a 14 day free trial and a smoother more structured building experience and prices start from around $18 per month. This website builder is ideal for e-commerce websites, so businesses that sell products online and blogging websites due to the elegant feel. While this is also a great option for local businesses, it does cost more and has limited integrations compared with Wix. However, in saying all this, both website builders are great options and I would sum it up by saying if you're a complete beginner, go for Wix and if you have a little bit more design knowledge and experience, then give Square Squarespace a go. However, at the end of the day, give both options a spin and see what website builder best works for your requirements in your small business. And that is it for today's video. You should now have a better understanding of both Wix and Squarespace as viable website builders for your small business in 2020. Now, if you have any questions, make sure to pop them down below. And with that said, thank you so much for watching this video. If you got value from this video, then please leave a like down below. And if you haven't done so already, make sure to subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Take care, guys.